So hi everyone, uh, Fiery Fa again. Um, so yeah, I want to talk about something. I'm a little bit annoyed. Actually, I'm very annoyed. Um, yeah, of course, first, my stupid lip here, my stupid dentist tortured me and, no, no, <laughs> he uh, slipped with his uh, machinery and ugh, just nicked me in the lip. Great. So now I have to rock around like I belong in a Halloween party. But anyway, so it was not what I wanted to talk about. I'm just, I am extremely angry and I'm trying just to swallow it in because otherwise I'm going to scream or talk too loud. But I'm just so tired of super great products changing their freaking recipes. Oh my God, I'm so tired of that. Uh, well, as you know, um, my hair is damaged, I have honey bleached hair and it's just super dry and I used to have like that silky silky smooth hair, like seriously I didn't have to do a thing for it, just use a, a good conditioner and stuff and it was all okay, but now with the bleach my hair is just like straw if I don't really take care of it, so I'm so angry because I, it took me so long to find something that worked for me to, to make this oh, grateful little mess happy again and make it a little bit uh, manageable again and uh, of course which I, I've talked a lot about this that I'm a real Aubrey Organics fan uh, I, I used three conditioners of them the Rosa Moschetta, the GPB and the glycogen protein balancing condition, you know, and then the honeysuckle rose conditioner. But now it turns out that uh, Aubrey decided to change the recipe. And of course, they're not... What annoys me even more is that they were not even honest about it. Um, they just changed it. So they, they said, oh, I'm just, uh, we're just going to put the more scientific names on the, the label. Uh-uh. I'm not stupid. I'm not stu stupid, Aubrey. Maybe you think that like a normal person who just smells it and thinks, mm, I will try this. No, uh, the wrong person to mess with. I mean, I'm, I'm a long hair freak myself. I'm not saying all long hair people are freaks, but I'm a long hair freak. I know how to read um, ingredient labels. I'm a little bit too obsessed about it. So I notice when some things change, I, I, I know um, the scientific names and the normal names, so don't try to tell me, because I emailed them, because I was really angry, I emailed them, uh, and they told me, like, no, it's just a scientific blah 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 no, it's not, you're lying, you're so full of this stuff, <laughs> you're really lying, it's a, oh, it's just a scientific name, no, 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 suddenly there's, like, soybean oil in it, and by the way, it's a cheap oil. They use it to make things in a cheaper way. I'm not saying it's a bad thing, but it wasn't in the um, in the recipe before. So you're full of it. Seriously, you're so full of it. And um, then it was it. They had yarrow. Now, so certain suddenly it's glycerin. Glycerin and yarrow are not the same. They have the same kind of properties. They are mean. They are meant for slip. But they're not the same. Don't tell me it's like the same recipe. Oh, God! <laughs> and of course, I was still hoping, oh no, maybe just, uh, nay, uh, probably it will be still good. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Because I, I keep asking around and putting posts on forum because I was freaking out. And, oh no, my favorite honeysuckle conditioner. Oh, God. I'm just. So angry, <laughs> and it's not um, it's not only only Aubrey. By the way, um, I think I'm going to um, erase my other videos. I already put a review on Rosa Moschetta. Uh, that hasn't changed yet. Yet I don't know if they're going to change it. Probably. Um, and then the GPP condition has changed. Um, the new one is coming uh, this way. I've ordered it, so I'm going to see if it's still okay. But I'm still angry that they are just like not honest about it, you know. I mean, don't think that people are stupid, that they that that they are not informed. So, certainly not in this googling age, if you know what I mean. So, oh God! But it was it's not only organics that annoys me because 
my routine was like using three Aubrey Organics conditioners and then I had like one Avalon Organics conditioner and they changed two. They changed all their conditioners again. Somehow positive because I'm happy that um, they don't use any cones anymore. Yay! Sorry, I'm not a cone fan most of the time. Uh, and I don't think cones belong in a natural product. That's my opinion. If someone thinks uh, something else, I'm sorry, this is my opinion. Uh, so, yeah, that was positive, but then they ruined my <laughs> extra moisturizing conditioner because it was already without cones. But then they said, like, no, more, su more sustainable. Okay, that's nice, it's thicker. I always like thick conditioners, I'm happy about that. <sighs> but now it's just not as moisturizing anymore. Please, dudes, fellas, girls. Whoever works there, don't, if you say extra moisturizing, it has to be extra moisturizing, not just a moisturizing conditioner, okay? My hair needs it, my hair, my poor, poor hair needs it, what I'm freaking going to do? You know what, you know what, let's take it outside. So yeah, here we are, outside. Maybe it will help you to remember how nature is supposed to look like and how your products need to be. They're, they're not supposed to worsen and become more mainstream like, um, yeah, like, I don't know. You're supposed to be organic, so stay organic. God damn it. Oh, I'm, so, oh, I'm just so annoyed by this. And uh, the same with Alverde, it's like a German uh, brand. They should watch this video too. They had like the most awesome products. And then they decided, oh, it's like, let's put glycerin and everything. And okay, I'm not anti-glycerin, but they had great products. And then suddenly they are ruining their products. Because uh, it, they don't smell nice anymore. Just the, It's not the same anymore. So if you have like a great, awesome product and you're getting more, a, 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 a better reputation, just keep, stick with your good product. Don't, don't change it for the, for the love of God. <sighs> So I'm just really tired of um, products changing. The same with Avalon Organics, they had like a really great lavender shampoo, then they changed it and now it's like really drying for your hair. So I, I would like to have like a little bit more of um, security um, that my products will stay the same, you know? Uh, it's so it's so annoying, so I, I, I never can really be at ease because it's always like Will I, will I have another condition? It took me so long to find the Aubrey Organics. I have to order it from iHerb because I live in Belgium. So it comes from freaking in America. And then you change it. Please consider people with long hair, thank you. Or people with dry hair or whatever. Oh, it's just, just such a shame. It would All three brands with an A. Maybe it's something about that. And I've ordered now a new brand because that what's, that's what will happen Aubrey, Avalon and whatnot. If you change your product, I will not buy it anymore and other long haired people won't buy it anymore too. And we're a big market and we use freaking lot of conditioner, you know, so you're, you're losing a lot of profit when we don't buy your products anymore. Uh, but now I wanted to try the Acure Organics condition, but now I have to laugh because it's also with an A, because, so probably it will be great for a while and then it will ch freaking change again. Oh my God. This is a really annoying um, situation because um, I'm really hoping that the Acura Organics, which one is the the, or the Moroccan or the or Moroccan Argon oil conditioner, the one for dry hair, will be my new holy grail because otherwise I will be in a big big trouble because I have lost my three Aubrey conditioners and my Avalon conditioner. Actually, everything that made my hair like m kept me from cutting it actually so uh, I don't want to cut it because I, I like long hair but oh god what the, what am I going to do so people you are warned they are Avalon is, has changed maybe for the good but I don't find this moisturizing more at least not the extra moisturizing conditioner uh, Aubrey has changed so you are, you are you are warned so I'm not making any I'm not advertising them anymore I'm not recommending them anymore just because they are they lie to me, you know? So, yeah, I don't know what to do. So if anyone has like a good su suggestion for a conditioner, uh, something really, really moisturizing, uh, Desert Essence Coconut Conditioner, for instance, I'm considering that. 
but I heard that it's not that moisturizing so yeah I need something really moisturizing like the honeysuckle uh, rose conditioner or the used to the, the late honeysuckle rose conditioner I should talk about like that um, yeah I don't know so if anyone has any su suggestions I like organic conditioners cone, uh, they have to be comb free and of course I need to be able to um, get them from iHerb or something if you're from the US because I can't get everything from America um, or the US sorry uh, so yeah if anyone has any suggestions and Aubrey if you would like to send a complaint to Aubrey please do I've requested other people to do that uh, to let you yeah, let yourself be heard and say like I realize it's not the same I'm not happy with this uh, just that they know they have to be informed because they they have to know that they can't get away with this you know um, so yeah that was it and if Avalon Organics they never replied to me so I d doubt they really care they already changed their recipe a lot so I don't really trust them <laughs> um, so yeah that's about it I think oh what's Sorry, yeah um, and Alverde that's another thing that's for maybe if people from Germany are looking or from the Netherlands or Belgium if you come in Germany Alverde used to be like a really good brand now I don't really I don't know oh, but it's just so frustrating but please um, like fingers crossed for uh, for the Cure Organics conditioner that I at least have one conditioner to take care of my hair and the rest it will be a whole new discovery to find other um, conditioners.